Hi, Susan. How are you? Hi. I'm okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, um, today we're going to do something new in therapy. Um, I want to help you um, learn and remember that every day, now that you're home, you need to uh, leave with your mom and get on a bus at 8 o'clock every morning, okay? We want you to remember that so that you can help her get you ready in time so that the two of you get out of the house so you can make the bus, okay? So you need to be ready to leave the house at 8 o'clock. So here's a picture of the clock, and this says 8 o'clock, right? Mm -hmm. So what time do you need to be ready to leave the house? 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock is correct. Yeah. 8 o'clock, you have to be ready to leave the house. 8 o'clock, what time? At, it, 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock is right. What time do you need to be ready to leave the house? 8, eight o'clock. Excellent. 8 o'clock. What does that say? 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock is the time you have to be ready to leave the... The bus. You have to be ready to leave the house. Leave the house. At 8 o'clock. At 8 o'clock. That's right. You got to leave the house at, at 8 o'clock. Excellent. What time? At 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. You leave the house at? At, at, at 8 o'clock. Excellent. So that quickly shows errorless learning where the uh, goal is to prevent the patient from making any mistakes by giving them the correct answer. In this case, we gave it um, on a, a schematic of a clock. You could use a real clock or watch um, in real life. Um, the hands of the clock were pointing to eight and the number or the time eight o'clock was written under the clock. Um, the patient did make one error because of a rephrasing by the clinician of the question, but the clinician quickly followed up with the accurate answer and then went back to the question posed as originally presented, again pointing to both places where the patient could get the answer to again reinforce the correct answer and prevent any future mistake. As time goes on with this, uh, the, patient, the clinician would fade, providing so much cues for 8 o'clock increase the amount of time over which the patient was asked to answer the question and um, hopefully master uh, errorless learning to be ready for the bus at eight.